subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi, welcome to Test Prep Training. Today we will discuss about, Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. A certification in Einstein Analytics, and Discovery will surely open new realms in your career. The Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant credential is a highly acclaimed certification, and definitely your way ahead. About Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. The Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant exam is intended for all those, who have the knowledge, skills, and experience with data ingestion processes, security, and access implementations, and dashboard creation. The Salesforce Certified Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant covers three components. First, Einstein Analytic. The Einstein Analytics includes, the Data Manager, through which you can bring in, modify, and publish data from different sources for enterprise database solutions. Second, Einstein Discovery. Under the Einstein Discovery, analyze, and gain insights from datasets. Also helps in presenting datasets in an easy format. It consists on analysis of what happened, why it happened, and how to improve a certain variable you've given it, such as, revenue, product sales, etc. Third, Einstein Prediction Builder. The Einstein Prediction Builder is a forecasting software. Its concepts are not covered in the exam. Now we will talk about, why go for Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. The Salesforce Certified Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant helps you demonstrate your expertise, and skills. It offers the following advantages. First, Salesforce certifications help you to increase your marketability in a tight IT job market, as they enable you to become a subject matter expert. Second, these certifications helps in attracting the attention of your potential employers to your resume, and makes your academic records shine. Third, this certification also opens path for you to grab lucrative career options. Therefore, bringing career growth. Fourth, many Salesforce salary surveys show that Salesforce certified professionals get more salary, compared to not certified professionals. Key skills developed in the exam. First, certification or experience with other business intelligence, extract transform load, analytics, and reporting tools. Second, an understanding of dashboard, or user experience design, and aesthetics for mobile, and for desktop. Third, competency in reading, and writing Salesforce Analytics Query Language, and Salesforce Object Query Language. Fourth, competency in developing ETL processes for dataset preparation, and management. Fifth, understanding of master data management. Sixth, competency with developing stories in Einstein discovery. Seventh, working knowledge of data science life cycle. Eighth, working knowledge of statistical analysis. Ninth, working knowledge of data modeling. Tenth, experience leading technical projects. Eleventh, competency in administering, configuring, and securing Einstein analytics. Twelfth, optional experience with administration, configuration, and securing Salesforce. Thirteenth, configure, and perform right back to Salesforce for discovery models. Now we will discuss about, target audience. People who have fundamental knowledge of working in the Salesforce Einstein domains, are surely the ones who can apply for the exam. Target audience generally have experience, and skills across the Einstein analytics, and Einstein discovery. Exam Details, Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. Let's have a basic understanding of the exam details. Exam Name, Salesforce Certified Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. Vendor, Salesforce. Number of questions, 60 multiple choice, or multiple select questions, and 5 non-scored questions. Time allotted to complete the exam, 90 minutes. Passing score, 68%. Registration fee, 200 US dollars. Now we will talk about, prerequisites for the Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant exam. For the certified Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant, Salesforce does not necessitate any prerequisite. However, it's recommended that you have at least one year experience in the Einstein Analytics ad discovery domain. Delivery options of the exam. The Salesforce exam can be scheduled either at an on-site proctored center or online with a virtual proctor. You can select either of them. First, on-site proctored. The Salesforce certification exam can be registered through their partner Criterion. Locate a favorable center, and register for the exam. 
Second, online proctored. If you want to attempt the exam from your own computer you may use online proctoring. Online proctoring allows taking Salesforce certification exams remotely from your own computer. These exams are monitored through a webcam. However, there are certain hardware and software requirements to complete the exam online. They include 1. External webcam 2. Criterion Sentinel Secure Software Registering for the exam First, create an account on WebAssessor at www.webassessor.com slash salesforce Second, click register for an exam on the portal Third, click on the Salesforce Certified Einstein Analytics and Discovery Consultant Fourth, expand the section to view the delivery options and choose from Fifth, on-site proctored Sixth, online proctored Seventh, then click on the register button after selecting your preferred delivery method Eighth, if selected on-site proctored exam select the testing center, date, and desired time to take the test Ninth, if selected online proctored select the date and time for the exam Tenth, click checkout after reviewing the exam and scheduling details 11th enter your payment type and pay through your preferred mode 12th click submit 13th a purchase confirmation screen would open select done now we will talk about exam retake policy in case you weren't able to pass the exam in the first attempt you can go for a retest the retake fee is 100 US dollars Salesforce offers you three attempts in a year to clear a certification Next is, Salesforce Certification Verification. You can check your certification status on the verification page of Salesforce to keep track of your certifications, maintenance requirements, and account linking status. Last is, Maintenance of Salesforce Credential. The new system feature updates are released by Salesforce three times a year. Each update requires all certification holders to maintain their certifications, with trailhead maintenance modules aligned, with the Salesforce product release cycles course outline first data layer which compromises 24% weightage for this exam second security which compromises 11% weightage for this exam third admin which compromises 9% weightage for this exam fourth analytics dashboard design which compromises 19% weightage for this exam fifth analytics dashboard implementation which compromises 18% weightage for this exam sixth Einstein Discovery Story Design, which compromises 19% weightage for this exam. Let us now discuss about course outline topics in detail. Number 1, Data Layer, 24%. It contains First, given data sources, use Data Manager to extract and load the data into the Einstein Analytics application to create datasets. Describe how the Salesforce platform features map to the model view controller pattern. Second, Given business needs, and consolidated data, implement refreshes, data sync, replication, and, or recipes to appropriately solve the basic business need. Identify the common scenarios for extending an application's capabilities using the app, exchange. Third, given a situation, demonstrate knowledge of what can be accomplished with the Einstein Analytics API. Fourth, given a scenario, use Einstein Analytics to design a solution that accommodates data flow limits. Number 2, Security, 11%. It contains First, given governance, and Einstein Analytics asset security requirements, implement necessary security settings including users, groups, and profiles. Second, given row-based security requirements, and security predicates, implement the appropriate dataset security settings. Third, implement app sharing based on user, role, and group requirements. Number 3, Admin, 9%. It contains First, using change management strategies, manage migration from sandbox to production orgs. Second, given user requirements or ease of use strategies, manage dataset extended metadata by affecting labels, values, and colors. Third, given a scenario, improve dashboard performance by restructuring the dataset and, or data using lenses, pages, and filters. Fourth, given business and access requirements, enable Einstein Analytics, options, and access as expected. Number 4, Analytics Dashboard Design, 19%. It contains First, given a customer situation, determine and define their dashboarding needs. Second, given customer requirements, create meaningful 
and relevant dashboards through the application of user experience design principles, and Einstein Analytics best practices. Third, given business requirements, customize existing Einstein Analytics template apps to meet the business needs. Number 5, Analytics Dashboard Implementation, 18%. It contains First, given business requirements, define lens visualizations such as charts to use, and dimensions, and measures to display. Second, given customer business requirements, develop selection, and results bindings with static queries. Third, given business expectations, create a regression time series. Fourth, given customer requirements, develop dynamic calculations using compare tables. Fifth, given business requirements that are beyond the standard user interface, use Salesforce Analytics query language to build lenses, configure joins, or connect data sources. Number 6, Einstein Discovery Story Design, 19%. It contains. First, given a dataset, use Einstein Discovery to prepare data for story output by accessing data and adjusting outputs. Second, given initial customer expectations, analyze the story results and determine suggested improvements that can be presented to the customer. Third, given derived results and insights, adjust data parameters, add or remove data and rerun story as needed. Fourth, describe the process to perform writebacks to Salesforce objects. Preparatory Guide, Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant. Step 1, Refer the Official Guide. The first step is to download the exam guide of Salesforce Einstein Analytics, and Discovery Consultant exam. The exam guide provides the authentic details about the exam course. Remember to refer the exam guide to have prior knowledge of your course that too in details. You should have complete clarity about the exam details, before venturing into the preparations, therefore the official guide is a must. Step 2. Refer books, your ultimate friends. Books have always been the most preferred resource, while preparing for any exam. They are a golden resource to gain in-depth clarity about the subject. There are a great number of books available in the marketplace for the preparation of Salesforce Einstein Analytics and Discovery Consultant exam. Refer the books that best suit you from the plethora of options. Step 3. Devise a time schedule. While preparing for any exam, you must focus on avoiding distractions. You need to chalk out a study plan keeping in mind the syllabus concepts and time left till the actual exam. Begin with strengthening your weaker areas and then moving on. Also try devoting time to your preparations daily. Remember, consistency is the key and a study plan will surely help you achieve this credential. Step 4. Go for Salesforce Training Course. Training courses help you follow a guided path with tutorials and increases your chances of clearing the exam. Also, it helps you in learning how to implement the exam concepts in real life, thereby providing you practical experience and hands-on training. Salesforce offers its own training course by Trailmix. Trailmix offers instructor-led training course. It helps you interact with your instructor in real time and also is beneficial in clarifying your doubts. Step 5. Join the community. Online forums and study groups are a great way to prepare for the certification exam. Therefore, Get in touch with other candidates through study forums, and get a chance to learn from their experience. Salesforce's own community known as Trailblazer Community helps you collaborate, and study with your fellow candidates. It also helps you to connect, and get answers from this very passionate community. Step 6. Attempt Practice Tests We know that practice makes a man perfect. Including practice tests in your preparation guide is a must. It helps you check your preparations, and also identifies your weaker areas. Strengthening these areas will surely bring success. Practice tests are designed to provide the real exam environment to you. Also, attempt as many tests as you can. The more you practice, the better you become. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.